You know something, Mr. Kelvin? You are you are right, and I actually agree with you. Because you see, tonight the Dwayne White Company should have gold. Mr. White should be the BCA hardcore champion, but he's not. And he's not because of little C. And you know what? I'm so sick of little T and big time. And you know what? Johnny Ewing squared up against Little T. Heavyweight versus Junior Beta Wrestler here. Two of the best in their own divisions. Johnny Ewing saying he taught you everything you know. Of course, Little T, a former member of the cabinet. 
Johnny Ewing, Uncle Calvin. Oh. Calling another tie up. At least Johnny Ewing throwing, shoving little T into the corner. Johnny Ewing, Lil T circling the ring. Get back together and collar and elbow, but Lil T ducks it. Kicks to the side of the leg there, takes down the leg of Johnny Ewing. Falls it up with a drop kick, goes for a cover early on in this matchup, and manages to get a two. Big right hand swinging against the face of Johnny Ewing. Lil T charging in, big clothesline. Gonna go for it one more time. No, a big splash this time. Johnny Ewing down on the mat. Oh, little T runs in with a big drop kick. Goes for the cover and gets a two. Multiple right form strikes there. Johnny Ewing pushes little T off, catches him. Belly to belly, suplex, oh! Right into the corner, Lil T landing awkwardly on top of his head. Johnny Ewing, a former heavyweight champion, former leader of the cabinet. Whoa. Up in the air. Big gorilla press slam from the Memphis Cowboy. Johnny has the legs. Ooh, a leg drop. All right, across the abdomen region. I want to invite everyone to come on out to the VCA Wrestling Show. We are live every single Friday night in the VCA studio. 4275 Winchester Road, Suite 3594. You can take your information on our Facebook page, facebook.com slash VCA Wrestling. Send us a DM. We'll get back with you. Ooh. With any information you will need. Hope everyone has enjoyed their Christmas so far. Now it's season's beatings here in the VCA studio. Johnny Ewing picks Little T up over his shoulder and slams him down on the mat. Comes off the ropes and a big leg drop. Puts down Little T. Goes for the cover and kick out at two. Johnny Ewing just throwing his little tee to the outside with ease. Johnny wants to have a word with the referee, but Uncle Calvin on the outside with that cane right across the throat. The little tee has to sharp into the stick. Ooh, another shot to the midsection. Uncle Calvin with her right hand. Referee trying to get Johnny Ewing under control. Johnny too busy having a fight with Little T's wife. He says as a fan at ringside. Uncle Calvin taking a beat into Little T. Johnny Ewing throws a right hand. Down goes Little T and up goes Johnny Ewing. Up from the middle rope. Will he hit the bullseye? Right across the top of the head. And a kick out at two. Sleeper hold applied. Lil T grasping at the giant arm of Johnny Ewing around the throat, trying to break it free to get some air. 
Little T might be losing, losing grasp of reality here. Hand goes down once. Goes down for a second time. One more time, this could be. Oh, Lil T still with us. Lil T trying to get back up on his feet. Stomp to the foot, breaks Lil T free from the hold of Johnny Ewing. Lil T bouncing off the ropes. Multiple clotheslines, only staggers Johnny Ewing. And a leaping drop kick finally puts down the big man. Multiple kicks now to the down Johnny Ewing. Coming off the rope, a leg drop. Another leg drop. Ending things with an elbow, what? No, and a big splash. Ending things with a splash, rather. Gets a two count. This matchup continues here in the VCA studio. Picks up Little T over his shoulders. Listen, Johnny was going for his own. Little T's on move to TKL, but a cutter. Oh. Tara Ray and Jason Hall out here. Tara Ray holding a kendo stick. Referee telling them to take it to the back. Referee and Uncle Calvin both arguing. Jason Hall and Uncle Calvin arguing with the referee. Little T sees Terry Ray get inside the ring. Terry Ray's gonna hit him. Oh, a shot to the head! She didn't mean to do that. Johnny Ewing gets struck in the head with that kendo stick. Johnny up, but is out of it. Rolls him up. One, two, and three! What a win for Little T! Ladies and gentlemen, here is your winner, Little T! A big win over former heavyweight champion Johnny Ewing. What a win for Little T! Miscommunication there from Tara Ray. A big shot to the head of Johnny Ewing on accident. Just caused him the matchup. Wait a minute, whoa, wait a minute. We saw these people last week. The terrorizers. These are Tara Ray's goons. Coming in, striking down. Terrorizer is going, destroying Little T. Little T in the corner. Terrorizer number two. Big Sinton, number one hits him. Little T gets dragged to the center by the Terrorizers. Big splash. Another one! Big time in a big close line! Double close line knocks down the terrorizers! Shoulder tackle knocks down terrorizer number two. STO knocks down number one. Wait a minute. Terror right with that kendo stick. Right behind, big tiny. Oh! Shot to the back to no effect to big tiny. 
Monster isn't faced. Oh, Big Tony grabs Terry Ray by the hair. And a headbutt sends down Terry Ray. Leg drop. Leg drop to Terry Ray. Terry Rogers back up. Stopping away at the monster. He's the owner of the company now. Terrorizers hired by Terra Ray. Big splash. Monster splashes to Big Tiny. That's rolling. Shut the hell up.
Christmas to all. I'm Spencer Beretta. Thank you for joining us here. An exciting night of wrestling action. Kicking things off. Dwayne White and Jared X. Rawlings. Both former champions, both former junior native champions. Going out at Dwayne White, president and CEO of the Dwayne White Company with a picture perfect headlock takeover. And the young Jared X. Rawlings. Jared X. Rawlings scheduled to compete against Tank for that VCA television championship at a cold night in hell. That's coming up on January 7th. You can get your tickets today on facebook.com slash VCA Wrestling. Send us a direct message. We will get back with you. Jared X. Rawlings has a challenge in front of him right here tonight in Dwayne White. Ahead of his match with Tank. Dwayne White, the former VCA Hardcore Champion, the inaugural one. Ooh, what an arm drag. Falls up with a drop kick. Couldn't make it look any prettier. Big body slam from Jared X. Rawlings. Son of a rock star. Dwayne White goes to the outside, takes off those sleeves. He's getting a little frustrated. Temper is high. Jason Hall trying to calm him down. Referee on five. Dwayne White follows suit, gets back inside the ring. This matchup continues. So Dwayne White lose that hardcore championship to Daniel Miraculous at Extravaganza. VCA's biggest event of the year. If you missed it, you can catch it on our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash VCA Wrestling. Oh! Don't go anywhere right now. One heck of a clothesline knocks down Jared X. Rawlings. Pounding away at the face and the flesh of Jared is Dwayne White. Dwayne throws Jared to the outside. Picks him back up, drapes him over the guardrail and a chop to the chest. Jason says, do it one more time. Ooh, multiple chops. Ooh, goes for another one, Jared. Smacks him twice as hard. Another one across the chest. Fans in the splash zone by splash. I mean, they can feel the sweat pouring off these men's chest. Oh! Back suplex on that apron. Dwayne White goes inside and outside to break the count. Pulls Jared X. Rawlings out as well. Has him on that steel post. He's gonna charge in after him. Joe! Oh! Dwayne collides with that steel post. Jared gets out of the way, sidesteps him. Dwayne could have just dislocated a collarbone there. Jared pushes Dwayne back inside the ring, goes for the cover, hooks the leg, and gets a two count. The official referee call two. Jared picks Dwayne up, but Dwayne raced the eyes. Immobilizing Jared X. Rawlings momentarily. Dwayne goes in for that cutter. Jared, a big roundhouse kick. Staggers Dwayne White, he can barely stand. Oh, swing. So that wide way it looked like, and a kill shot. A kill shot from Jared X. Rawlings. Wait a minute, here comes the terrorizers. This match over in disqualification. Terrorizers going right after Jared X. Rawlings. Sarah Ray personally hired these, these two masked individuals to wreak terror on the VCA roster. Jared Rising number one with a big slam. Number two coming off the ropes. Big splash. Another one takes down Jared X. Rawlings. 
My name is Jason Hall and I am the agent for the Dwayne White Company and I'm here right now to introduce you to our corporate security team that are the terrorizers. And now we should be challenging for the VCA Hardcore Championship at a cold night in hell. But you know what? It looks like we got to deal with a wannabe wrestler called Little T. <laughs> and Little T, I promise you this. At a cold night in hell, you're going to find out why the Dwayne White Company is the best thing going to do. Number Q versus the Wolverine. The bell has rung and this match begins. Tavis versus Q. Garna will lock up. Both men struggling to get the advantage here. Tavis looks like he has the strength advantage over Q. Gets Q in the corner. Ooh, a chop across the chest. Followed up with some forearms. Right hand shot to the face of Q. Q staggering further and further down in that corner. Tavis looks at Irish whip Q, but Q reverses. Tavis slides, grabs that arm from that clothesline, gets off the ropes, swinging and missing a drop kick. Down goes Tavis, goes for the cover and a kick out of one. Stomp to the back. From the Black Mamba. Davis now up on his feet with the help of Q. Oh. Davis tries to throw Q to the outside, doesn't realize Q stood on the apron. Big forearm shot there. Q goes to his favorite corner. Oh! Springboard forearm. He gets a two count. Black Mamba Q, once a member of the Royal Flush. Kicked out by the leader Brooks. Fresh whip here. Q just recently made his return. Oh, wait a minute! Max Tavern! Black Mamba Q must know what that feels like from his previous fight here with Carlito at Extravaganza. Q holding on to that back for sure, he's still recuperating from that matchup earlier this month. Davis, the longest reigning television champion in VCA history. Winning it at 2020 extravaganza. And he beat Michael Clark. And we'll see Michael Clark, Q, and Black Cat compete in six man tag team action at a cold night in hell on January 7th. They will go up against the Royal Flush. Oh. A chop across the chest from the Wolverine and another one. So that's Q up on the side of the ring. Laid up against those ropes. Iris whip. Q comes firing back. Oh! That clothesline turns Q inside out. Q laid out by the hands of the Wolverine. Davis having a word with fan at ringside. Davis has the throat of Q draped on that middle rope. Burying that knee into the, the swallow of the back. Trying to choke out Q and another shot to the, the spine it looked like. Vicious shot there from Tavis. Ooh, a shot across the chest. And in a suplex position. Ooh. Shots across the back there. Uh, uppercut sends Q to the outside. 
We'll let all you fans know at home that VCA does hold live events every single Friday night here in Memphis, Tennessee. We're looking at 4275 Winchester Road, Suite 3594. That's Winchester Road between Perkins and Goodlett. And that just is 4275 Winchester Road, Suite 3594. You can get your tickets on our Facebook page, facebook.com slash VCA Wrestling. You send us a direct message for the event you want to attend. We'll get back with you with more information. We'll go ahead and get your tickets early for a cold night in hell, cold night in hell on January 7th. Davis now with the sleeper hold, apply the cue. Mocking the crowd. <laughs> Retaliating back on him, the crowd here chanting for the Black Mamba Q. Q fights back with a shot to the ribs. Couple shots, breaks him free. Q coming off the ropes, gets extra momentum charge again after Davis. Davis catches him, power bomb position. Oh, almost bends Davis all the way backwards there. And a sling blade. With Sling Blade and both men now down. The referee starting the count. These two men going at it. Two charges in a big close line to Tavis. Followed it up with a back elbow. Ooh. Close on miss, right hand shot from Tavis. Tavis catches him belly to belly slam. Take this time to let everybody know that. On New Year's Eve, VC will not be holding a show on a regularly scheduled Friday night. Instead, we will be doing a New Year's Day, January 1st. VC will present a very special show. Just kick off the new year. Tavis going for that backstabber once again. Super kick attempt from Q, but he misses. Tavis tries to bring him down for that cross face. He has the arm locked and the face wrenched back. Q so close to those ropes with his feet, but tries to get out of it, rolls Tavis up, that's a pin. That's a two count. Oh, a Venom kick! Takes down Tavis. Venom Q, one, two, three, that's it. Tag team action underway, greatest on earth, representing the Royal Flush. Going up against Black Mamba Q and the Black Cat. And a cat and a snake teaming up with each other. Sounds like a Disney cartoon. Brooks having a moment with a member of the audience. All right, now let's get to the action. Black Cat's ready, I sure am. Tag team action underway. VCA tag team champions competing in a non-title matchup here. We've seen the greatest on earth take on Black Cat before with different partners. He's brought a different tag team partner tonight in the Black Mamba Q. Let's see how these two can fare a chance against the greatest on earth. And they are just that, the greatest on earth. Eight time tag team champions here in VCA. Brooks has been in the ring with them all. Jerry the King Lawler, to Leo Rush, to Davey Richards, to Carlito. 
The Rogues have squared off with all of them here in the VCA ring. The technical wrestling here. The wrist lock to a hammer lock to a leg sweep to a cover. Only gets a one. An arm drag there. May not have been pretty, but that makes it more effective. Was pulling the arm out of socket there to drag the black cat over. And locks him in with an arm bar. Shoots him off the ropes. Fires in with the kitchen sink. Knee straight to the stomach. Brooks falls into the ropes. Into the corner there. Ooh, a big drop kick. Black Hat firing back. Wrist lock applied and a tag out to the Black Mamba Q. Rooks breaks free from the hold. Just to get a split second to recuperate. Black Mamba Q brush off some other competition from earlier in the night. Black Mamba Q circling the ring. Ready for competition. I talked to Q in the back, he said he's ready to fight. He's ready to come out here, give the fans what they want. The fans want the Black Mamba Q. He tries to shoot Brooks off those ropes, but Brooks holds on for dear life onto the Cranium, the Black Mamba Q. Switches arms there. Goes back for a hammer lock. Back elbow there from Q. Q comes off the ropes. Brooks catches him. The huge hip toss followed up with the clothesline. An elbow drop misses. And that drop kick. Brooks cowards are way to his corner with Malik. Holds on to the foot. Brooks just wants some safety in his corner. Malik there to relieve him. 20 plus year veteran is Malik. Okay, swooping down for a waist lock, followed up with a headlock takeover. One of the best to ever step foot in the DCA ring is Malik the Great. Son of a sniper. Late great Charlie Parks, father of Malik. Taught him everything he knows. Look at the Irish whip. The Black Mamba Q. Oh, up and over. Q almost trips on the shoulder of Malik there, but lands on his feet anyway. Oh! Spinning wheel kick. Oh! A Pele there. Knocks down Malik, but a kick out of one. He may just kicked out a little too early, getting a little woozy. There's no rest for the wicked, however. Kitchen sink to the gut of Black Mamba Q. Frees Malik up for just a few moments. But Malik going right after Q. Front face lock here. Brings Q into the corner and tags out. To the Pharaoh Brooks. 2021 Velocity Cup winner. Winning that Battle Royal at Megafest. Securing himself a title shot. He secured those championships with Malik winning the tag team titles. Q goes to the outside, courtesy of Brooks. Kicks him out with his foot, quite literally. Brooks getting the referee's attention, bringing him over the black cab, but Malik, he just undid his wrist tape there and using it as a choking apparatus on the Black Mamba Q. Black Cat trying to get inside the ring, but the referee forcing him back, telling him to get back in his corner. Unbeknownst to the referee, Grace on Earth taking control. Ooh, kick out at two. 
That was close to a three. And remind fans, we are live in the VCA studio every Friday night at 8 p.m. here at 4275 Winchester Road, Suite 3594. Located between Perkins and Goodlit on Winchester Road. We will not be here on New Year's Eve, however, but we will have a show Saturday, January 1st, 2022. Kick off the year hot. Ooh, a big back elbow there from Malik. Besides New Year's Eve, we're alive every single Friday night. If you want to get tickets, ticket information is available on our Facebook page, facebook.com slash VCA Wrestling. Back to the action here. Back suplex there from Malik. Onto the Black Mamba Q. Gets a two count. Malik tags out. In comes Brooks, grabs one leg each and a wishbone. Well, that Q wishes he had his groin back. Grace on Earth just took it from him. Foot on the right ear of Q. Put on those ropes for extra pressure. Referee forcing the break. Look at that. Gouging at the eyes now. Referee counting. Gets all the way to four before Brooks has to let go. Now, Brooks complaining with a referee. Like, he didn't just do something illegal. Brooks pushes Q into the corner, which is that neck back. Flash and a bulldog from Brooks. Grace on Earth in control here. Black Mamba Q already competed against the Wolverine Tavis. Brooks almost put his hands on the referee there. Why I do not know. Angry young man. Ooh, shots in the midsection and a rush to the leg sweep. Down goes Q, hooks the leg and a kick out of two. Black Cat put one leg inside the ring, ready to break up that count if he needed to. Black Mamba Q prevailed and kicked out himself. Chin lock on the Black Mamba Q, center of the ring. He can't get to the ropes, he can only get up and out. As he does so, back elbows to the ribs, breaks free. Well, right hand shots and an eye rake from Brooks. Puts the grace on earth, momentum back and sick, oh no! Pop up stunner from Q. Q might just turn this thing around, but he has to capitalize. He has to get up to get the advantage. Looks like he might be leaning towards Black Cat for a tag here. Brooks using those ropes as a crutch, so to speak. A tag out, in comes the Black Cat, and in comes Malik. Close line, followed by a back elbow. Malik, the knee to the gut. Whoa. Impressive gut buster from Malik the Great. Ishop off the ropes. Black Cat comes firing back. Leaping leg drop one, two, and a kick out of two. Black Cat says it's time to end this. Wait a minute, it comes Tavis. Black Mama Q into even the score here. Michael Clark firing away. That Tavis. Oh, Brooks just collided with Black Cat. My eyes were diverted just like the referees were. Oh, greatest power bomb on earth. That does it. Fatal four means anything goes. Every man for himself. Big motor going after little T. Simba going after the hardcore champion himself, Daniel Miraculous. 
It's every man for himself, so Simba using that rope, that bull rope. Try to choke out Rick Henry. He puts Big Motor down to his knees with that dragon sleeper applied. Little T in here strikes down Simba in a right hand from Simba. Daniel Miraculous grabbing that steel chair. Ooh. Club to the back from Big Motor. Daniel forced to drop that steel chair. Slams Daniel into that corner. Multiple shoulder strikes. Oh, wait a minute. A chair shot to the back from Simba. On to Big Motor Rick Henry. Simba slicing them up. Ooh. Another big shot to the back. They don't call him the hardcore icon for nothing. Ooh. The edge of that chair, putting it across the back, and now against the back of the neck. Little T punching away, forearm strike, sends Simba down, crashing to the mat. Little T now, taking that steel chair. Being the back of big motor Rick Henry. Daniel Maracas with that cookie sheet. Swift shot to Simba on the outside. Ooh, another shot with that cookie sheet. The DDT from Little T, and the cookie sheet bends in half over the head of Daniel Miraculous. He's not playing. Simba trying to wreck the face off of Daniel Miraculous. Little T with the splash there to Big Motor. Daniel straightening up the cookie sheet before it planted across the face of Simba. Little T and Big Motor squaring off in the ring. But Daniel Miraculous sees Motor from behind and plants him with that cookie sheet. Oh! Good God! The sound effect it's echoed in here in the VCA studio. Daniel picks little T up and slams him down on that steel chair. Technically a cover referee in the right position, but Daniel Miraculous steps off of little T, decides to go up to the top rope. Oh, throws a steel chair into Daniel. Daniel barely holding on, almost crashes and burns into the crowd there. Little T chasing up after him. Well, shot sends Little T down. Little T gets back up on his feet though, goes right after Daniel Miraculous once again. Rick Henry up, he's heading towards Little T. Big Motor looks to do a power bomb and a super flex! One man tower of doom. Garcia, Big Motor, Rick Henry, every man's down. Except for Simba and Big Motor. These two Goliaths. Whoa! He just picked up Simba with ease. Goes to show the strength. A big motor, Rick Henry. Big motor has that Mississippi strength. Going all the way from Tupelo, Mississippi. Ooh. Little T face first into that corner. Barely able to stand. And we're actually with a steel chair to Simba. We were ringside. Ooh! A knee across the face. Sandwiching the head between the knee and that steel post. Oh! Suplex from Big Motor Rick Henry. What a hardcore match. Championship not on the line. Big right hand shots there from Daniel Miraculous. 
on the big motor Rick Henry. Oh, headbutt there sends Daniel crashing and a steel chain from Simba. Use across the forehead of Little T. Oh. Simba goes crashing into that guardrail. Fall away slam. Wow. What strength from Big Motor. Bounding away the face of Little T. Big Motor puts Little T off the ropes. Little T comes firing back and gets hit with the clothesline. Oh, Daniel with the steel pipe, it looks like. It's like a steel pipe around the throat now of Simba. Daniel looks to take out the hardcore icon. He grabs that steel chair. Right hand shots from Little T on the Big Motor. And that steel chair shot right to the ribs. Direct shot. And he'll hit him again. Oh, over the face! You see that? There's a dent in that steel chair with the imprint. A big motor's forehead in it. Daniel and Little T teaming up now to take out the big man, big motor Rick Henry. Smart strategy. Oh, Simba crashing into my table. Knocking over. A chair. Good God. It's gonna be mayhem here in the VCA studio. This fatal four-way matchup. Big motor face first into that steel chair. It's planted into the skull of Rick Henry. Oh, both men going at it. It's the thickest high five I've ever seen. Daniel has Little T up on his shoulders. Little T now has Daniel up on his shoulders. Tries to hit him with that TKO, but Daniel catches him. Double underhook. Something's gonna happen. Wait, Little T grabs him. And a sleeper hold. A sleeper hold from Daniel. We've seen him end matches with this move before. He slings Little T in the corner. Ooh. Strike after strike. Ooh, a big back elbow graces the top of the head of Little T. Sending him into the corner. Wait a minute, look out behind you. Oh, a spear, but he misses him. Little T grabs onto the head. Little T fed to the dog. Oh, a spear from Big Motor. Spear from Big Motor and a cutter from Little T. Simba looks to end things. Belly to belly. Whoa. Whoa, wait a minute. Simba might have hurt his back there. Simba holding onto his back. That was going to go for a cover. I've had a spasm in his back from the abuse he's taken in this matchup. Simba, unable to stand, kneels down towards the steps here at ringside. And Miraculous back up on his feet, picks up Little T, looks to use that steel chair. No, wait a minute. Ooh, big motor in there to break things up. What a match this has been. Even larger tray across the back. A big motor. You want to see hardcore action like this? You can tune into VCA every single Friday night live and in person here in the VCA studio. 4275 Winchester Road, Suite 3594.
We're on Winchester Road between Perkins and Goodlett. Again, that's 42.75. Winchester Road, Sweet 35.94. Ticket information, you can get that on our Facebook page, facebook.com slash VCA Wrestling. Just send us a direct message for more details. Back to the action now. Danny Miraculous grabs Simba, throws him back into the ring. He grabs that good kendo stick. Changes his mind, grabs a steel chair. Most deadliest rest. Most deadliest weapon in wrestling. Ooh. Another shot across the gut. Simba hardly able to stand. Daniel, full swinging with that chair. Daniel has Big Motor Rick Henry up, and Big Motor grabs Daniel by the back of the head, slings him into that rope. Has to go after him, but Big Motor falls up and outside of the ring. Ooh, chair shot across the face. Daniel going right after Big Motor and a shot to the midsection. A club to the back. Oh! Shot across the head. Little T. Lance Simba on the middle rope and a 901. Little T's arm stuck in that bottom rope. Might have just cost him. As it is. Oh! Dwayne White with that kendo stick. Hardcore match means no rules. Interference is technically legal. And Dwayne White taking off his shirt. He's entering himself into this matchup. That twist of faith from Simba. Simba going for that cover. And that's it. Hands on little T. Not to help Simba. Watch that in slow motion. You can see the candlestick wrap around the body of Little T. Oh, wait a minute. Jason Hall calling out the terrorizers. Terrorizer number one and two stomping away at Little T. Pick little T up, throw him into the corner. Simba looks to come in here, even up the odds. Terrorizers, oh! Simba cuts him off. Another clothesline, takes down the Terrorizer and Rick Henry in to get revenge as well. Big motor with a knee to Dwayne White. Dwayne White not even a part of this match. We saw Simba get the win, but the chaos continues. Big motor setting him up. A little T coming off. Terrorizers. Grab Dwayne, bring him to the outside. I want to thank you for the assist, man. Hey, whenever the Royal Flush is there, the Black Mama Q will be there. Q, I would like to thank you as well. However, unfortunately, it wasn't enough to get the win tonight. But I'm going to tell you two something. In a cold night in hell, I will be better prepared. And the Royal Losers will find out. <laughs> <laughs>